Contrary to what you may have heard or read, the suicide rate does not peak during the holidays. In fact, suicides are most common in spring and summer. The holiday suicide spike myth persists because it has a convenient narrative. Lonely people become despondent around Christmas. So why do people kill themselves in the spring? Possibly because they interact more. Doctors first observed in the 1820s that suicide rates spike during late spring. Researchers have since postulated and tested all sorts of explanations for the global phenomenon, making this one of the most studied questions in psychiatry. There's no consensus, but researchers point to so-called sociodemographic factors. During the winter, many people go into semi-hibernation. They work less, see fewer people, and are exposed to less frustration and conflict. That all changes in the spring, when increased interaction with others and stress of work may trigger suicidal thoughts. Some believe that climate may account for seasonal changes in the suicide rate. Some suggest that sunshine triggers suicidal thoughts, making self-harm more common in months with longer days. Setting the epidemiological data aside, clinicians say that people suffering from winter depression often lack the initiative to kill themselves. One woman told her psychiatrist that she went to the basement in January to commit suicide and even selected a pipe from which to hang herself, but she gave up when she couldn't figure out how to tie a noose. Summer depressives, in contrast, are more likely to have a dangerous combination of energy and desperation.